Hey everybody, I'm Lisa Young Sutton and it's time for another live daily draw. Now my intention today is just for a quick advice message for all who are watching and for those of you who are not in need of any advice, uh, just let this uh, reading expand your knowledge of the Lenormand cards. All right, so let's see what we get. Um, let me clear my space here. All right. I'm going to leave the cards face down until I'm ready, which I, for some reason, sometimes feel like doing and other times I don't care. But I always do where, I always go where I'm led. All right. And the last card that feels good is this one. Okay. I think, I think that's good. All right. Let's see what we've got. We've got the birds the key, and the garden. Hmm. Well, we find birds in the garden. Let's see what we've got here. Okay. Now, the key appears to offer a solution. And following the birds, it's offering a solution to the unrest and mental clutter of, of the birds, right? It wants to close the door to the unease of the birds and open the door to the expanded world of the garden. Um, now think about your keywords for your cards when you do this. I'm looking at the birds now. Have we bitten off more than we can chew by multitasking? I thought of the keyword multitasking. And then why, why you would need a solution for that, right? Okay, are our lives so hectic? another keyword, right? Hectic, that we're constantly overstimulated and reactive. That's all the birds. Therefore, we need a solution, right? And it looks like the solution lies in getting out, getting out of our heads, getting out of the house, or just opening up to others. That's the garden, right? Okay, so the key is releasing us from a stressful situation by opening the door to a bigger world, um, maybe to expansive thinking. Because the garden follows the birds, the key, we could say the key is releasing the birds into the garden, yes? Um, you just wanna think of it in any which way you have to, to get the message. What could this be saying, these three cards? Should we Lighten our loads by delegating tasks to others. Lightening your load. The key is opening and letting the birds out. You're lightening your load, relieving all these everyday stresses by delegating tasks to others. Um, will relief come to us by finally revealing something to others? Right? The, the key reveals things. Um, or by finally you know, coming clean or going public with something that's been driving us crazy. Ooh, think about all the ways these three cards could answer all of your questions. Now, people are often confused as to whether the key is appearing to open or close a door. Um, and that one kind of stumps me because I, I've, I've never had that problem. So to me, it, it does both. It just depends on your question and the other cards and the order of the other cards. Okay, wait, hang on. What if we were to switch these two cards? This might help for those of you who have a problem with that. Let's switch the, now we have the garden, the, the key, and the birds. Okay, so in this scenario, I would say that opening up too much to others or too much socializing and, and gossiping, right? The, the birds is the card of gossip and here we have the social card, right? Um, is causing stress because, you know, here we're moving from the garden to the birds. So here, too much of this is causing this, right? Um, yeah, okay. So are you trying to please everyone? Do you have trouble saying no? The, the, the key says yes, right? You're saying yes to too many people, which causes the, the um, unease of the birds. Um, do you have a problem with gossip? either creating it or taking part in it, right? This would be saying that this is the, the cause of your unrest, right? Um, yeah, okay, so hopefully that helped somebody. 
Now let's put the cards back. We had Bird's Key Garden. So what is the message of the cards today? Um, I would say that the key to relieving disappointment and misunderstanding is to simply confirm key issues. <laughs> Looking at the key, confirm key issues with others, which means not relying on gossip or third party information. That is the key to relieving disappointment and misunderstanding. Did I say that right? The key to relieving disappointment and misunderstanding is to simply confirm key issues with others and not rely on gossip or third party information. That is the message of the cards today. Woo! Okay, thanks for watching as always, my friends. And please thank me by liking and sharing and subscribing so I don't feel like I'm all alone here behind this camera. And if you haven't already done so, check out my new Facebook group, Lisa Loves Lenormand. Woohoo! It's a new place to play with your cards. <laughs> okay, everybody. Bye-bye. See you in the next video.